right guys, today we got a building problem with one of our domestic boilers and only three out of the four are running. This bottom ram right here is not running. We've got a flasher. Let's see what's going on. We got one flash, low air, low air on startup. Let's pull this panel apart and check it out. Got one fan running. That fan is not running. And our third fan is running. Boiler keeps tripping to low pressure. Middle fan's not running. Let's fix that. Looks like someone already replaced a pressure switch on this one. There's the old one sitting right there. If we follow these lines, here's our incoming power for the blower motor. Let's go ahead and check this. Always test your meter before using it. We have power. Now when I put my hand on this motor, it's hot. It's about to burn me. So let's check this capacitor. Even though I've got a hundred, it's the motor. Just gonna remove the just gonna remove the entire motor. It's only held in by three nuts. Although I'm pretty sure that the motor is bad, I'm just gonna check the capacitor just to be safe. 12.5 MFD is what the capacitor calls for. We are well in range of that. Good thing we've got a new motor in stock. Gonna use the plug off the old motor. Then wire that plug up to the new inducer motor. Putting the new inducer motor into the boiler. There's some wires that are rubbing against the edge, so I had to lift those up before putting the new motor in. Tighten the new motor down. Now, 
going into ignition. Wouldn't even do that before. We're heating, baby. Commercial boiler repair.